getting ready for the uh, Patreon live stream for October 2015. This is actually going to be the first one that we've done, despite the fact that it's been on the uh, Patreon perk list for a year. Right, Cat? Oh, I'm trying to figure out how Google Hangouts works, because you have to use that to go live. Glenn got the pre-live show Chipotle. Well, we just finished the live stream. We had a bunch of uh, internet problems. Even right now, still, the internet is just dead, so we're restarting the router. I need internet to do my job. Come back, please. We are going to a place where they have frozen yogurt and also caramel apples because that's what Caitlin wants. Two of my favorite things put together. Caramel and apples? Yeah. Are you trainers. kidding? It's not even Trigger dark trainers. yet, kids. Think, you can't do this. I think a lot of uh, what the cities heck? have changed trick-or-treating times to start at like 4 and go until, I don't know, 7 when it gets dark. What? Which yeah. I think is bogus. The enjoyable thing for Halloween for me was like, ooh, you can be outside with people when it's dark. But the how does the city, is, is, is it like you're only legally allowed to trick-or-treat during this time? Or do they just say, we recommend you do it? Yeah. Uh, it's too early. You gotta do it when the sun goes down. That's when all the ghosts and witches come out. Are you yawning? Yeah. Caramel apples. In most situations, I say caramel. But when you're talking about apples, it's always caramel apples. Look at all of the apples. That one's Halloween-y. And that one has oh, Jesus, worms. That's so much. That's, that's too much sugar in one thing. There's what do you want? never enough sugar. Oh, God. Is this hurting your <laughs> soul to look at all the sugar? Why would you cover caramel? It's so delicious already. I tried to pay for my frozen yogurt with my Visa card, and it was declined, so I called the bank. And they were like, well, somebody tried to use your credit card in the Bronx, New York. So they've canceled my card and they're sending me out a new one. It's kind of annoying because now all of my accounts that use that credit card number are going to have to get changed to use a new number. But I guess that's good that someone didn't get free hamburgers on my dime. Hope it was real embarrassing for them. <laughs> How do you use a credit card that you don't physically have? I'm not really just... sure. I guess maybe there's some way to program a card with a number. Yeah. Yeah. If you used it possibly where they had a number skimmer, so it got the number off the mag strip as it was being read. They put them in various like unattended gas stations, things like that. Mm. Then they get that data. Then they program any card, any mag strip card. I mean, it's more technical than that, of course. Well, that's just not very nice. Well, you got your trick. Not quite a treat today. Yeah. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween! Dang, look at that Mustang. That's a real nice Mustang. I bet it's real fun to drive. We've been working on building the brand new Michael Aranda store. So these are my, my fancy uh, poorly drawn mock-ups of what will end up being product images of hoodies and stickers. Those are supposed to be stickers. And holiday ornaments. That's Einstein. Okay. Do you want pizza or do you want wings? Wings. Wings? Mm -hmm. Do you want pizza or do you want wings? Do I have to only have one? Okay, do you want pizza or do you want wings? I said, do you want pizza or do you want wings? Kitty. Hey, kitty. Kitty. It's time for some French practice. Practice and beat the clock. This stresses me out. Il dort. Il dort? Uh... Uh... Ooh, I got it. You put down the hat. I don't know how to say put down. Uh, to, what's put down? Uh, le chapeau? Oh, there's only one P, and it's E-A-U. You sell 
the shoes. Hmm. I only got four points. Oh my god. I just, it's a typo. It's, I wouldn't say he dress. It's obviously a typo. Oh my god. This is embarrassing. I'm turning this off. Well, it's raining. And, uh, it's kind of cold. I think today was a really nice, laid-back day. Nothing too crazy happened. I felt relaxed. After traveling for literally the last three weekends, this felt good. 